hello guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel how are you guys doing this early morning yes morning here in brazil and i'll be home all through today that's a lie <laughs> i'll be going out with my um client today to the hospital and yes i'm helping green gator guys take their clients to the hospital today so i might be videoing making a video of the public hospital we're going to today but anyways welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel guys my name is rurala and i'm your host as usual on this beautiful amazing channel now i want to thank you guys for subscribing i want to thank you for liking and all the other nice things you've been doing to this youtube since i created it if you're a new subscriber do not forget to subscribe share like all we talk about here on this channel is relocation to brazil how to change your visa from student visa no from tourist visa to student visa how to come and invest here in brazil brazil is becoming a very stable global economy and you cannot afford to miss out come and buy a property here and trust me try green tour guides you guys don't understand they'll start to give massive testimonies very soon try them out be careful not to go and give your money to <laughs> bad agents here yeah. you know <laughs> as i was saying as we talk about new subscriber welcome to this channel my old subscribers i love you guys so much thank you for subscribing thank you for every 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 you guys are the absolute best so guys in this video you guys i'll be speaking about the best technological and engineering universities that we have here in brazil technological and engineering universities that we have here in brazil there are about 12 or 10 of them so i'm going to be listing them and that means i won't be showing my face all through this video because i want you to get the spelling right the entire screen is going to take up the details of the school the name some of the pictures of the campus uh, you know so many information about the school so that when you're searching for it you search rightly and not you know get frustrated because you don't speak portuguese okay so um that's what i'm going to be doing in this video best technological and engineering universities here in brazil is it to interest you that brazil has one of the best universities offering technological and engineering courses here in brazil so in this video that's what i'm going to list for you guys so come on guys let's get right into it welcome back guys yes yeah, so i'm going to be starting with the university of sao paulo this is this video again i'm emphasizing it is many universities with engineering and technology programs this is not general university for education arts medicine all those things this one is specifically for engineering students and technological students so let's go the first one we have is usb it's called the university of sao paulo in portuguese it's called universidade de sao paulo it's a public university and it's currently considered as the best in the country at this moment it is considered the 143rd best in the world according to the qs you know world ranking the undergraduate degree we focus on engineering and technology technological and the engineering courses they take place in escola politecnica all the spellings you can make mistakes if you are not seeing them on the screen because i would like for you to search for them and make your own research on your own okay so it's also in the city of sao paulo and then these two schools the one for engineering is called escola do engineer for the sao carlos and the ones for poly, um te technical school is called escola politecnica now again let me explain something very important you know i have made videos of vocational schools and then of this is what well, this one is technical school now that i just got People that have been asking about vocational schools don't make the mistake that this one is referring to you guys also. This is technical schools and yours is vocational schools. Okay, this is not in any way related to vocational schools. This one is a complete course. This is like it can even be compared to polytechnics. Do you understand? But vocational schools are not technical schools, please at least in brazil i don't know about other countries 
so this one is technical not vocational also it will interest to know that this um, university they offer postgraduate courses doctorate and phd courses so it's a proper universities these are the ones i'm making in this video they are proper universities so it's like in unilag where we have school of medicine but it's still on that university of lagos but then we call it school of medicine so it's like this too university of sao paulo but school of engineering school of um, technology and so on so some common engineering courses they offer there is um aeronautic engineering computer engineering electronics engineering mechanical engineering and the rest of them like that so you should make a research and see if it suits your course or suits your pocket or suits your whatever it is you're trying to become in life for number two we have unicamp entire abbreviation of unicamp is a university to dial the campaign like university of campaigns and it's one of the main institutions in the country where um, graduation courses in several fields and then is one of the most prestigious university here in brazil it's very tough to get in you have to be smart and your essay and all those other transcripts has to be very very neat it's ranked as the number 150 no 195th best in the world it has one of the most competitive admission as i've just said earlier. college of technology is located in the city of limeira so this institution they promotes extensive research programs in several courses especially in engineering with laboratories for telecommunications semiconductors and computing 30 percent of all phd graduates in electrical engineering in this country is from this university <laughs> So you must see that probably even after you know after graduating from this school you don't even need to stress either they give you internship or they don't give you internship the fact that you have their school you are an alumni of their school in your cv in your transcript or whatever you should know that education i mean jobs is sure for you here yeah. okay you're getting the job if they see that ah unicamp what ah you must be really smart though mm -hmm. or god must really be by your side it's number three we're moving on to ufsc uh, it's an abbreviation for university federal university of santa catarina in portuguese universitas federal de santa catarina and um its campuses are located in several cities i don't know why that is so it means that in another city in another state you might be called a student of university of santa catarina because they have several campuses in different states and this university is considered to be ranked as the 24th best in latin america hmm. and the seventh best in brazil according to the u i mean according to the ruf ranking the engineering courses offered in these universities are a special me mechatronics and automotive and the technical um, technological institute the facility has laboratories for telecommunications integrated circuits machinery microprocessors and bioengineering if this is what suits you it is your engineering department you can also look into them make your own research and start to apply to their campuses and number four we have the popular ufrg i'm saying popular because it is located inside of rio de janeiro it's called the university or the federal university of rio de janeiro in portuguese universidade federal do rio de janeiro it is highly recognized and um, it's very known for its quality in education and research in several knowledge fields. It has um, campuses located in Cidadas Universitaria, Praia Veimela, Masai, and Serre. With a total of about 40,000 students, UFRG is considered to be the five best in Latin America and the third in Brazil. Okay, Carioca's rep. Among the technology courses that they offer are control and automation engineering, mechanical engineering, computing and information engineering, electronics and computing engineering, 
bioprocess engineering science students you guys are the luckiest honestly I'm saying after every video if all the schools are to your interest make more research on them you have every information you need to make research and decision on your own number five we have you ufp ufp ufpe and it is called university of pernambuco it's also a federal school so they call it federal university of pernambuco ufpe um, it's considered the 10th best in brazil and is offering more than 106 courses to more than 30,000 students they have campuses in cities of um, Caru, Aru, Recife, Vitoria, the Santo Antonio, and then in all the states of Pernambuco. They are Centro of Technological and Geoscience. They offer courses in engineering courses such as computing, electronics, mechanics, and energy. So for number seven or eight, I guess, we have UNESP short form for federal university or state university of paulista julio de mesquita filio now my pronunciation might not be correct that is why this video is showing you the spellings so that you can help yourself the this university is located in sao paulo and um, yeah, it's located in several cities throughout the state of sao paulo such as um, sao jose de campos Baru, Sorokaba, and so much more. This university is considered the most successful example of a multi campus university in Brazil. Their engineering courses at UNESP are among the top 10 best courses in the country, according to that UF board. Number eight, for the first time throughout this list that I've been making, we have a private institution. This one is called Mackenzie or Teriana Mackenzie. I think this is person's name and it's a private school and it's located in the city of Sao Paulo. Okay, it has additional campuses in Campinas, in Rio, in Brasilia and in Barueri. This is the 32nd best university in the country. They have engineering courses with specialization in um, electrical and mechanical engineering, which includes telecommunication, automation, and mechatronics. Number 10, we have Central Universitario FEI, FEI. So if you put in FEI, it's going to come out. It's going to show you this university and help yourself further. So it's also a private university with facilities located in this same Sao Paulo. There's so much going on in Sao Paulo about education. So much going on there. And um, its facilities are also... FEI carries research in automation, integrated devices, and robotics. Search for them and search application. For number 10, we have UFMG. Short for Federal University of Minas Gerais. Portuguese word Universidad Federal de Minas Gerais and is considered currently as the third best university in Brazil and the best, excuse me, and 11th in Latin America. Among the courses offered by the University in Technology fields are Aerospace, Automation and Control, Electric and Mechanics. And the last on our list here is called ITA or Aeronautical Technology Cal Institute yeah, and the Portuguese name is going to be Instituto Tecnológico do Aeronautica. It's a public institution related to the Brazilian Air Force. The institute is located inside of the Department of Aero Special Science and Technology in the city of São Jorge de Campos. It is considered the reference in teaching of engineering in Brazil. The following undergraduate courses with 22 other specialization postgraduate courses. They have aeronautic engineering, electronics engineering, mechanical aeronautic engineering, civil aeronautic engineering, computing engineering, and aerospecial engineering. So that's all for today. Let me recap everything I have said earlier. 
and then i have said it again this is not vocational schools these aren't vocational schools these are technological and engineering schools that's what we are closing with on this video today if you found this very useful then kindly take your time and go through the video and start to plan your application essays start to plan your transcript and every other things you need for admission processing by april and in november okay guys thank you for watching always see you guys in the next video ciao